Abdullah bin Mas'ud radiallahu ta'ala anhu, he was asked that, can you tell us how the Prophet of Allah is to decide? You know what he said? He said, you know me, you're asking the right person because لَقَدْ أَخَثْتُ مِنْ فِي رَسُولِ اللَّهِ صَلَى اللَّهُ عَلَيْهِ سَلَّمْ بِضْعًا وَسَبِعِينَ سُورَةً He said that I have learned approximately seven, over 70 uh, surah chapters of the Qur'an from the mouth of Rasulullah صلى الله عليه وسلم. So you're asking the right person. And then Abdullah bin Mas'ud, he said, the Prophet صلى الله عليه وسلم, the way he taught us how to recite the Qur'an, he said, لَا تَهُدُّ الْقُرْآنِ كَهَذِّ الشِّعْرِ Don't read the Qur'an like the way you would read poetry. You know, some people, they really boast about this, you know. I was uh, looking at uh, some of the social network yesterday. Someone wrote, he goes, Alhamdulillah, in our masjid, Isha Salah, 20 rakat Tarawih, as well as Witir, all finish under one hour. MashaAllah, I'm like, wow, I really want to this. People are boasting about this. I don't know how the Quran is recited. I'm not going to expose the masjid like that because everybody is going to go there. <laughs> one hour quickly, you know. But do you know what? Poetry, asking, you know, the poetry, for example, that's how they should read. They should read very fast. It's like rapping in English, for example. The Prophet of Allah said, don't read the Quran. Sorry, Abdullah bin Mas'ud said, don't read the Quran like this. Abdullah bin Mas'ud is telling us because he learned from Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa And then he demonstrated to his students. He said, the Prophet of Allah said, alhamdulillahi rabbil alameen, yamuddu madda. He would stretch and he would stop at the end of the verse. ar rahman ar rahim And he would do mad. You know, and he, demonst he demonstrated like this as well. And he said, Allah says, وَرَتِّلِ الْقُرْآنَ تَرْتِيلًا Recite the Qur'an in clear manner. This is, this is the way the Prophet of Allah recited. That's why we recite the Qur'an slowly, that's all. The idea is to contemplate. That's the whole idea. Do tadabbur. Even if you don't understand Arabic verses, you know the verses of Jannah. You know the verses of Jahannam. You know the verses when you say that, you know, اِتَّقُوا الله. You know, these are, so try to pick on these words, inshallah ta'ala. And by the way, forgive me. Don't make... Arabic an excuse saying that we don't understand Arabic language. Many of us, we didn't know English language. We all learned it. Make an intention to learn Arabic language. Even Taymiyyah, Shaykh al-Islam, Ibn Taymiyyah, rahimahullah ta'ala, is to say, make intention of learning Arabic, because learning Arabic is a ibadah. It's a worship itself. So make this intention, inshallah, that I will learn Arabic language. Why? To understand the book of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala.